This might be the most hated card ever released by EA in Ultimate Team history. Already there are 11,000 dislikes for this player item and today I'm going to see if this card is worth it in FC24. For cheap and fast, reliable FC24 coins, check out MMOEXP, the link is down below, and use the code MATHD to get 5% off all of your orders. So here she is guys, she's arrived into my ultimate team, and I actually can't wait to see what a card's like, it's very intriguing, and this card from the looks of it, stats wise, looks kind of broken, great all round stats there. And to be honest, she's going to link well with Alex Morgan. Some great links already in the same league. They are her stats though. 5 for 5, high work rate, 4 star skill moves, 5 star weak foot, controlled explosive. Can play as a cam, left mid or left winger as well. And they are her in games. They are really good in game stats there. She's also got the finesse shot plus. So I think she might be banging in some goals for us. I am very intrigued and excited to try this card. I will be honest, it looks good. It does look good. This is the team End of Era Rapino will be involved in. She's in the starting 11, good to go guys. Got Alex Morgan, a striker. We have Socrates icon, a bit of a mad hybrid squad this. I do like this team. However, I will be using her mainly as either a cam in the 4-2-3-1 or as a left winger in the 4-3-2-1. So they are the two formations I'm gonna try and see where she's best suited to. However, how does she play in game? And let's see how she gets on. First game here, we've got Madison, Trailblazer, we've got Depay, but Megan Rapinoe, I wanna see what she's like in Ultimate Team, man. Let's go. How's R1 dribbling? I'm guessing amazing. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. How's her finesse shot though? Long distance. Still going here, guys. Okay, let's go. I think she's five foot five, guys. And right there, you can tell. Top left. Bang, Rapino. Thank you for the first goal, Megan. Let's see what else you can do. That is an absolutely brilliant run. Her runs, guys, and movement are stunning. Should be a goal, this. Yeah, that was quality. You saw her run there. That was fabulous. She might have the most hated card ever here. On the verge of being that card, anyway. But... You can't deny her movement there off the ball was fantastic. That was unreal. Well played. And again, she is so fast, by the way. She feels more like she's got like 93 pace rather than is it 88 sprint speed, I think she's got. Way faster. It's her agility that makes it feel way faster, though. Well played again. R1 dribbling, guys, is so broken with the right players in this game. Oh, what a goal! That was actually a great finish there, man. Good first game there for Rappiner. What I'm noticing about her card, by the way, she's got a hat trick as a cam, is that she's really quick, really agile. Her finesse shots are going to be broken if you do complete her. And if you guys have like a um, women's, is it Super League in the American, um, well, American League, then she will be very, very good in your team. I mean, huge upgrade for any cam position. She's, she's definitely, absolutely though, better as a cam. Her movement is unreal. She's a good striker, but as a cam, she can be lethal. As a left winger as well, she's superb. The weaknesses of a card though, already I'm noticing, and we're gonna get into more gameplay now, is definitely the height. She'll never win any headers, let me tell you that. She will never win any headers in the air, being like five or five. There is just no chance. And one massive like positive with her card as well is that five star weak foot. So as a cam with the finesse shots, guys, she's gonna be lethal for you. But be honest, comment down below, will you complete this card? Or are you gonna avoid? Now, a lot of people might be asking, why do people hate her so much? Best to probably Google that. However, there has been a few videos like the one where I think she had like a kid come up to her at like an awards event and she just kind of did, you could tell she wasn't even looking at the kid when she when he was um, he wanted the autograph and then she just didn't want to be there kind of vibe and didn't even give mind contact. It wasn't a good look as a footballer and uh, yeah, that's just only one thing, but there's a lot more if you Google. She is a good striker though, like I'll be real, with those finesse shots, she could be really, really good with Alex Morgan in the same team, but overall, I just feel like she's a much better uh, cam kind of player. She really, really is. She just gets in those positions really well. Have you just seen that goal? I am not gonna lie, this card is incredible. <laughs> mm. 
That was outrageous. I was patient there in the end as well. You might not want to admit it, guys, but this card is a bit overpowered, and that is saying something. Seriously. So overall, Rapano's card is genuinely broken. I am genuinely being serious. Seriously, she's got an amazing card. Comment down below that will you complete this very controversial player SBC. Now, to make you guys aware as well, I mean, if you head over to Footbin and take a look at her card, I told you guys about 20 minutes ago, maybe a bit longer than that, maybe 40 minutes, give or take, she had 11,000 dislikes. Now, as you can see in the top right corner, she has, I think, 17,000 dislikes, which is kind of crazy. That might be on its way to the most hated card ever. Comment down below as well, what is the most hated card we've ever seen on Footbin? I might uh, DM them later and see, but that is, you know, what we're dealing with here. Now, again, look at the finishing though. 88 is a cam. 88 in terms of the finishing there. You've got 86 sprint speed as well. And in general, her card was really, really good fun. Four goals there in just two games. And in general, a phenomenal, just broken card. You can see from the stats, she's going to be very fun to use. I do think she'd actually be a very good box-to-box -box center mid with her dribbling. One of her best traits was definitely R1 dribbling. That was, as you saw, very overpowered. If you do master R1 dribbling, Rapano's great with it. For me, though, it is the finesse shot, and with having five-star weak foot there is such a good uh, stat to have. And honestly, if you guys have 97k, and in terms of in-game, this SPC is definitely worth it. I will say they're probably a solid 9 out of 10 card for me. Comment down below, though. Will you guys complete Rapano's SPC? Are you going to be doing the, you know, gritty celebration with Rapano and Foot Champs? Let me know. Have a very special day, and I'll see you on the next one.